friends, welcome back to my Sichuan kitchen. Today I'm going to show you a very classic traditional Sichuan noodle dish, Sun La Fen, aka hot and sour glass noodles. In the back streets of Chengdu, you can find these noodles freshly made with sweet potato starch. Today we can buy these noodles dry from grocery stores and make it at home. It's super delicious and it really brings me back home. Now let's get started. Today we're using dried sweet potato noodles. The ones I bought came in bundles and each bundle is good for one bowl of noodles. We are going to fry some peanuts and soybeans for topping. Simply add some oil to a pan on medium low heat and slowly fry the peanuts. It takes about 8 to 10 minutes. Top with some salt and mix well. We will use the same process to fry soybeans. Remember to keep the heat medium low. If the oil is too hot, the beans can be burnt and turn black easily. Take out the soybeans and set aside. The peanuts are so crunchy and tasty. One important ingredient for the soup is chili oil and today we're going to make some quick chili oil. Now this is a shortened way of making chili oil if you don't have any. However, if you want the complete method of making chili oil, I linked my chili oil recipe on the screen. We will combine some chili powder and roasted sesame seeds. Mix it up. Heat up some oil. Today I'm using canola oil and any oil without flavor should work. When bubbles come out, testing with chopsticks, adding the spices. I'm using one piece of star anise, one piece of cinnamon, and one bay leaf. You can use your preferred spice mix for the oil. Slowly fry for about 10 minutes. When the spices become darker, take them out. Carefully pour the oil into the chili powder mix. Stir from time to time. Add 1 teaspoon of vinegar. The heat from the oil will evaporate acetic acid in the vinegar, leaving the fragrant flavors in the chili oil. Now the simple homemade chili oil is ready and we're going to make the soup base. In a soup bowl, combine garlic paste, Sichuan peppercorn powder, salt, light soy sauce, vinegar, a little bit of dark soy sauce, 3 to 4 tablespoons of chili oil, plus 1 tablespoon with sediment. Add 1 teaspoon of lard, Lastly, add 1.5 cup of boiling hot chicken stock. If you're a vegetarian, simply replace with vegetable stock. The soup is all set. Let's cook the noodles. Drop dried sweet potato noodles in boiling water and cook for about 8 to 10 minutes. Here are the toppings for the soup. We have fried soybean and peanuts, finely chopped celery, finely chopped green onion, preserved mustard tuber, aka zha cai, and some fresh bean sprouts. You can find preserved mustard tuber in most Asian grocery stores. The noodles are ready when you can break one in half with chopsticks. Add to the soup and then add the toppings one by one on top of the soup. Be generous with the toppings and I love to have lots of fried peanuts in my soup. It is looking beautiful and here you have it, traditional Sichuan Suan La Fen, hot and sour sweet potato noodle soup covered in red chili oil. Let's give it a try, I cannot wait. It's so good. The noodles is super slippery. The soup is spicy and sour. It's exact the flavor from my hometown, Sichuan Chengdu. Thank you guys so much for watching today's video. I had a lot of fun making hot and sour noodles. Make sure to comment, like, and subscribe, and I'll see you next time.